a student snapshot looks like this. It has all of their classes here to the left and on the right where they're supposed to be. It has a little pink dot. And if they're missing um, or what their scores are. So for example, like this student has 19 out of 19 out of math. That means she finished math. Um, but English is a struggle for her. She has four out of 11 and six out of 11. Now, if she felt like she wasn't quite sure why she had that, she could pull this up. Um, and so you can look right here and you can see that she has threes for assignments. So that means she was proficient. Um, but some of them are 2.5s. And, and as the teacher or the program is just a program. So it will not update their overall score to a three. That is the teacher's job. And so I look at this. I'm the teacher. I created the assignments. I know that, sorry, that these act responses, she got chances to redo those and to redo those. Um, her theme essay was supposed to be done on it by herself um, to demonstrate full mastery. And she still has a 2.5. So um, I did give her some feedback, but she's back there working on that. And so until that gets done at a three, I'm not going to update the overall standard um, to proficiency for a three. Same thing with source material. She has one assignment. Um, that's all we did for that particular um, standard. And she scored a 2.5. Um, you can see here her first time out, she scored a two, but then she scored threes. And so I updated the overall to a three. And so they're able to get in here. And so even though they can't see the task grade book, they can see when I have entered the scores for that particular task and how that shows up into their snapshot. And then they're able to ask me questions about that.